If you look here at our lot, this thing has so many hills on it that when it comes down time for sledding, we're gonna have so much fun on this job site. But one of the problems that we're facing is our actual drainage at the front of the property. Once we got this site built up, we watched the way the water was coming with the first, probably within the first week, we got a really good downpour. And we could see that the water naturally wanted to shed off to the right and shed off to the left. But one of the big problems that we're gonna have here is our driveway. So this is a double driveway. It's over a little, about 21 foot wide. The amount of water that's going to come down off of this driveway is all going to try to collect down towards the house because we don't have the natural slopes that we have out here on the rest of the lot. Is if you look back here at this roof line, there's three different roofs that come together at one point back here at this corner. That's a lot of water that's coming off at one time here. So what we've decided to do was on the front of the house, we've got some underground drainage that's going to come off of this end, off of this side, and then one off of the right side here. And there's also another one on the other side of this garage. One thing that we've decided to do is put in a dry riverbed in the front of the property. So there's gonna be a nice flower bed here with like a Japanese weeping cherry. Same thing on the other side of this valley. And what we're gonna do is come off of the corner here and run a river bed that's gonna kind of come down and wind a little bit, give it some character. The pop-up drains off of these gutters are gonna dump right into that river bed. For the driveway is, if you can see where these stobs are at, there's gonna be a, a level drain going from this corner here all the way to this other corner. That's gonna catch all the rain that's coming off of this driveway headed to the house, catch that in that drain and run off to the right side to our, our swell on this side, or it's gonna bust out and come down this riverbed and collect all of this water. So once you're in this stage, you start doing your grading and everything, this is a major thing because you don't want to do all of this work, get the house right, lay sod, do all of these things and then realize you got a lake forming out in the middle of your yard. This riverbed has been in the plan since we started this project because we knew we were gonna have an issue up front with our water. If you don't plan for your watershed, erosion is one of the things that can completely just de demantle everything that you've done.